Dr. C. K. Deepa, and I work as a senior consultant in Department of Ophthalmology at Apollo Hospitals, Bhuvaneswar. Today, I'll talk about pink eyes. Not all pink eyes are infected. So we have patients walking into our clinic with red eyes, itchy eyes, watering, a lot of irritation. Some may have discharge as well, but then all pink eyes are not infected. Why? Because there are two variants into that. Some of the patients are purely allergic conjunctivitis. So the outer surface of your eye becomes inflamed when you're exposed to allergens. It could be dust, it could be dander, it could be pollen. So the, the treatment that is required is just some soothing eye drops and cool compressors to your eyes, which relieves you of your itching immediately. But when we talk of the infective variant, the pink eyes that come with infections, which could be viral, which could be bacterial, they need to be addressed as they are highly contagious and can spread into the community through droplets. We don't get infections by just looking at a patient who has infective conjunctivitis. That is one myth that people should understand. It spreads only through droplets if you spread your secretions here and there using the same towel, same handkerchief, then it may spread into the community or other family members. So you need to be careful and you need to check with an ophthalmologist who can give you treatment related on what infection you have in the eye. In allergic conjunctivitis, all you have to do is wash your eyes with nice chilled water which gives you enough relief from the itching. In infective conjunctivitis, you need to consult your ophthalmologist. If it's a viral infection, generally the patients would have a lot of watering and irritation because your tissue is all swollen. So it gives you a lot of discomfort every time you blink your eyes. Cases which have bacterial infections would have a lot of discharge with matted eyelashes. It becomes difficult for them to open their eyes and they may also complain of some amount of pain due to swelling around the tissues. These are cases which need assistance, which need treatment by the doctor. They have to be prescribed antibiotics for a long term, at least for two weeks for them to come out of the uh, infective stage.